the new BMW 5 Series, a tasteful update to the 6th generation of the spacious sports sedan that cast the mold for its entire segment four decades ago. The modern design envelopes classic BMW proportion with a shape that's been aerodynamically refined for lower fuel consumption, it's performed dazzle over every mile. The 2014 BMW 5 Series is a mid-sized luxury sedan available in four different trims level that correspond with engine choice 528i, 535i, 535d which stand for diesel and 550i. And today I'm going to review the 535i model. Rear wheel drive is standard on all models while X drive models are all wheel drive. Up front you see the Xenon adaptive headlight with dynamic auto leveling, LED corona headlight rings and cornering lights. High intensity retractable headlight washer as well as park assist are also built into the front bumper. The iconic BMW double kidney grille. Shadow line exterior trim. As well as rain sensing windshield wipers with adjustable speed. This particular model comes with 18 inch star spoke light alloy wheels with 245-45 run flat all season tires. Behind the set of wheels is the four-wheel ventilated anti-lock disc brake with composite front rotor and dynamic brake control and brake pad wear indicators. Side view mirror with integrated LED turn signal light. To the back, you see the LED tail lamps, LED brake lamps, an LED turn signal lamp, LED tail lamp with fiber optic effect, which make it look real nice, especially during nighttime. At the bottom, you see the dual round chrome tip exhaust, and here's the backup camera. There you go, which will activate once the vehicle is in reverse. Park assist are also built into the back bumper. Alright, on the remote we have the lock, unlock button, trunk open, and panic button. Alright, with the key in your pocket, push the button on the door handle once to lock. After a few seconds, put your hand on the door handle to unlock. The interior features black Dakota little seats, black on the dash as well as door panels, with piano finished black wood trims, as well as aluminum trims all around. Looks really nice. Alright, let's get into the car, start it up, and see how it sounds. With your foot on the brake, push the button to start. Alright, let's pop the hood and see what I have to offer. Under the hood is a 3 liter BMW twin power turbo inline 6 cylinder engine, 24 valve, pushing out 300 horsepower and 295 pound feet of torque, combines a twin scroll turbocharger with variable valve control and high precision direct injection, rear wheel drive, 8 speed Steptronic automatic transmission with sport and manual shift mode and adaptive transmission control, auto start and stop function, can hit from 0 to 60 in 5.9 seconds, EPA estimated fuel economy is 20 CD, 30 highway and 24 combined. 
two position memory system for both driver and passenger. All four windows are fully automatic and side view mirror does offer folded options. BMW aluminum door seal and here's the pedals alright here's a closer look at the seat both driver and front passenger seats feature 10-way power adjustable seat with 4-way power lumbar support and memory system for driver seats steering wheel and outside mirrors the three-spoke design steering wheel is fully wrapped in leather feels really nice with multi-function control side by side for your convenience so that you don't have to take your hands off the wheel while driving and it does feature tilt and telescopic steering column here's a look at the gauge over here we have the driver side air vent light controlled and the interior lightning controlled Alright, at the center of the dash we have the large multimedia screen, beautiful wood trims, dual air vent, emergency hazard light and door lock, multimedia controlled, dual climate controlled, dual cup holder and a 12 volt power outlet. Here we have the gearbox, just press the unlock button and push up for reversed. Once you're in reverse, the backup camera will display on the navigation screen with guidance line for a much easier backup. Press the unlock button again and push down for drive. Push slightly up for neutral and press the P for park. Here we have your traction control off, sport and comfort mode, park and brake. Here is the controller to your infotainment system. You can move the knob around to move around screen. Also can move it up, down, right or left or push down to select. Very easy to use. Here we have the ashtray center storage compartment truck block 12 volt power outlet USB and auxiliary input glove box compartment here is a closer look at the seat it is not perforated but does comes with heated options up here we have the one touch open, close and tilt moonroof. Light controlled. Universal garage door opener, sun visor mirror with a card holder, alright let's take a look at the back, the back is very spacious and offers seating for three, rear windows are also automatic, alright let's get into the back seat and see how comfortable it is here's the look to the front cabin looks really nice the back feels really comfortable with a lot of legs room here we have a dual air vent for the rear passenger and storage compartment as well as 12 volt power outlet here's the rear light control rear seat pocket 
rear armrest, storage compartment, and dual cup holder for the rear passenger. And here's a look to the back. All right, let's take a look at the trunk. The trunk offers 14 cubic feet of cargo space. If you need more cargo space, you can simply fold down the rear seat for extra cargo space. One touch close. All right, the fuel cap is located on the passenger side. And like I mentioned earlier, in the back, there is enough room for a pair of six foot adults to be comfortable and the back seat is nicely contoured and padded. With the 5 series interior design and special features, both driver and passenger will be quite pleased with the 5 series cabin as it is elegant, spacious and comfortable. The rest of the dash has a clean look thanks to the standard iDrive interface that minimizes the need for buttons. Overall, the 5 series is a great mid-size luxury sedan which makes a great use for individual or small family with two children. Alright guys, that is it for today's review. I hope you guys enjoy it. Go ahead and leave me a comment letting me know what you guys think about the 2014 BMW 5 Series. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more future video reviews. I'll see you guys next time.